everyone welcome to my channel I'm Coco and for today's video I highlight two different things the first one is Colourpop's wild nothing collection and the second thing is magnetic lashes from the company lash liner so wild nothing collection and lash liner magnetic lashes so if you're interested in either one of those things or like the look that I came up with keep watching and I'll show you how I got it so for today's look I only used two eyeshadow colors and two different brushes so like I said I'm gonna be using the wild nothing palette from Colourpop and the first shade that I'm gonna go in with is no bounds which is a deep chocolate color sorry color and i'm gonna be using the e1 color pop brush to put that on and i'm just packing that onto my lid in a kind of half moon pattern So the second shade I'm going to go in with is Vagabond and I'm going to use the ColourPop E9 brush to put that on and I'm just blending out the edge of the No Bounds color so that it looks a little softer. Okay, so I'm going to try magnetic lashes for the first time. I ordered them from a company called Lash Liner. This is what they look like. So you get the lashes, which are like normal top lashes. And then I think these are bottom lashes. I'm not quite sure. I'm not going to use them because I'm not that advanced. But I ordered these lashes in the style Dallas. And it came with the lashes and the magnetic liner. So I am going to try them for the first time. So I did not read the instructions, but common sense and my college degree tells me that you use this liner and then you put the lashes on. So that's what we're going to do. So here we go. We're gonna take the liner and put it on. And I just put on a real little bit of liner because I don't want to go crazy. Okay, so we're gonna let this dry and then we're gonna put on the lashes. So, here we go. Oh, there was a mirror in here. Is this a mirror? It's mirror-esque, we're not gonna use that as a mirror. So, I feel like you should wait until the liner dries, so. then we're just going to pop this on and it should just stick I'm assuming so let's see what happens it 
it did just stick. This is amazing. Amazing. Wow. That was super simple. The other one. I can't see my eyes, so I'm gonna use my other hand. Now for primer, I'm using Maybelline Master Prime 300, which is the green bottle. And I'm also using Maybelline Master Blur Stick for primer. Um, I only use the blur stick under my eyes and on my nose, but the other primer I put all over my face. So not only do I love this tinted moisturizer, but also I wanted to use as many ColourPop products as possible. So I went in with the Pretty Fresh Tinted Moisturizer from ColourPop. I use the color Dark 20N, and like I said, I love this. I feel like it gives you as much coverage as a foundation does, but it's so much lighter and the color is perfect on my skin. For concealer, I'm going in with my ColourPop No Filter Concealer in the shade Dark 48. And I'm putting that under my eyes, on my nose, on my forehead. And then I'm going to take the same brush that I used to put on my tinted moisturizer and blend that out. But instead of rubbing it, I'm just patting it in. Then, of course, for setting powder, I'm going in with my Sasha Buttercup setting powder and I'm putting that everywhere that I put the concealer. So to contour my face, I'm going to be using Kylie's Bronzing Powder in the shade Almond. And ColourPop makes all of Kylie's products, so I feel like it's still a ColourPop product. And it turned out very well. So now I'm going to go in with the No Bounds shade that I used on my eye and I'm going to put that right under my eye and off camera I'm also going to put on some mascara on my bottom lashes. For blush I'm using my ColourPop blush sticks in the shade under pressure 
and I'm going to take my um, angled highlighter brush and I'm going to use that to blend it out. For highlighter, I'm going to use my ColourPop Light Sticks highlighter in the color Bullseye. And again, I'm going to use my angled highlighter brush to blend that out as well. And then earlier, I used my Maybelline Lasting Fix Setting Spray to set my face. On my lips, I'm of course going to be using a gloss, and this gloss is actually from the Wild Nothing Collection, and it's in the shade Playa Vista. everyone that's it that's the complete look so all in all I like this new collection from ColourPop but you already know I love ColourPop I use their stuff all the time and as far as the lashes go I really like them they were super easy to put on um, this lash started to come off a little bit but it was because I didn't put enough liner on so I added some more liner and now it's Gucci so I would definitely recommend buying them um, they didn't cost that much and for what you get I think it's great you don't have to struggle with putting on the lashes it's just a simple application so definitely go purchase them like I said I got the kind Dallas and I'm gonna put them in the description box below if you have any questions if you like the video if you didn't like the video comment and let me know thank you so 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 much for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe thanks bye